My name is Joshua Wairi and I am a customer success manager at Smile Identity. We'll be talking about document verification and document verification is the process of validating the authenticity or the legitimacy of a document. Basically document verification works by uh, OCR. A machine would take um, a document and then read the information that is there, collect security features if that's needed and then say that the, indeed this is um, a, a legitimate document or not. Usually we see passports being verified, uh, national IDs, uh, voters IDs, driver's licenses, um, and basically just any document that is government issued. Uh, those are the ones that we usually see that are verified. Document verification has quite a number of use cases. Primarily the ones that we see as Smile Identity are compliance, financial inclusion, as well as prevention of fraud. For compliance, um, the law usually states, especially for companies that are in the fintech space, that they do need to know who they are interacting with, in this case, their customers. So document verification allows those companies to know who their customers are by getting to um, see their face through a selfie and also at the same time verifying the authenticity of the document that has been provided. When it comes to fraud detection or fraud prevention, usually what we've seen at Smile is um, people presenting uh, altered IDs, for example. The machines are able to see, to look for security features, perhaps a hologram, a watermark, or whatever other security feature is um, in that particular document. Also, it's able to look at the document itself and see whether it does look like other documents um, like the one being presented. So in this case, uh, document verification will prevent fraud by making sure that an altered ID is not presented or it does not pass as an original ID. Companies use document verification for a myriad of use cases. One use case is getting to know who they are working with. It could be an employee, it could be a customer, or it could be a supplier. Here at Smile, we support the effective use of document verification through facial biometrics. Someone would take a selfie of themselves, take a picture of the ID, and then our machines would match the, uh, the selfie and the ID photo on the ID that has been presented. For a long time, document verification has been manual. So assuming you wanted to open a bank account, uh, you'd have to physically go to the bank, present your ID, and the person who's assisting you would verify your, your face alongside with the uh, photo with, on the ID. But then uh, with the OCR technology that I mentioned, document verification has become quite or very automated. It allows for scalability in the sense that you're able to verify people faster. It allows for efficiency, meaning that you don't have to go to the bank to verify, uh, to get verified. You can actually take a picture of yourself and also take a picture of, uh, of your ID and you get your bank account opened. Or for example, if it's a company that is working with agents, then these agents can actually sign people on the fly basically by taking a picture of them and also of their ID and sending them up onto whatever platform it is that they want to sign up on. Pretty much any company in any sector can use document verification, be it insurance, be it health, be it uh, cryptocurrency, be it um, education, be it remittances. And for example, with remittances, you'll find that because of how cross-border it is, document verification allows for prevention of fraud people are able to know who is sending the money and who is receiving the money because you're able to verify the ID, you're able to verify the authenticity of that ID and you're able to prevent issues of uh, fraud or also stolen money. Thank you for taking the time to listen to me talk about document verification. In case you'd like to know more about it, please feel free to reach out and we're more than happy to have a conversation with you with regards to it.